I would like to start out by saying that amazingly, we've got four matches scheduled already for the Money in the Bank pay-per-view, which is one day after the uh, Hell in a Cell pay-per-view. They actually announced four matches. The show's July 18th, so there's almost a month to build this thing up, and we already have well, we don't uh, have all Money the in the... We don't have all the participants in the matches, though. No, but we have a uh, Money in the Bank ladder match with Ricochet, John Morrison, Riddle, AJ, and then actually it's AJ, no AJ and no Drew AJ. McIntyre. No it's AJ. one of these guys. Uh, AJ, Randy, and Drew McIntyre are going to be uh, having a final chance next week. One of those guys is going to go in. And then uh, four other names. We have a women's Money in the Bank match with Asuka, Naomi, Alexa, Nikki, and four others. We have Lashley, Kofi Kingston for the WWE title, and we have Rhea Ripley and Charlotte Flair for the women's title. So four matches no already announced for this show. I know. That, that needed a stipulation. I mean, it, it, the most obvious stipulation is no DQ, and they couldn't even or, do or, that. Or, it was just or, like, or, title can change hands on a DQ. Sure, either way. Yeah, yeah. They obviously Dead. needed that. Yeah. Well, I mean, they still have four weeks left, so they can still announce it if they need to, but you would think that they would have to put one of those tips into that match. Only if they were doing logical booking. Well, yeah, but we can hope. I like to hold out hope. How can you Foolish? Hold? How can you hold out hope? Did you watch the show last night? Yeah, I watched the show last night and this night. Uh, this well, the show tonight, well. the show today was 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 pretty good. I thought the show, you know, the show. I mean, and and you know, I didn't even think the, sh- the really like Hell in a Cell. Like, it really wasn't a bad show. The finishes were terrible. That's all. You know, I mean, there's nothing. You know, but and I guess that took it down. I mean, other than that, it was a good show. But you can't say other than that because the finishes were rotten <laughs> for the most part. And uh, they didn't, you know. But I mean, at least, <coughs> at least in some form, um, some of it sort of makes sense. And I was like going crazy when I saw like Drew McIntyre's name in the Money in the Bank. But they did explain that as long as Bobby Lashley's champion, even if he was to win the Money in the Bank, he can't cash in, you know, on Drew on uh, Bobby Lashley. So he's in the he's in the tournament that that. But he, you know, so if he wins. And for all we know, he will. You know, then it's on hold until that would be a, a different one. But, but, I mean, actually, it would be a different one because, like, if you were really all in on Bobby Lashley, you could have Drew win the Money in the Bank, and he, he can't, can't cash, cash in. in. If and if Bobby holds the title for a year, he can never cash in. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's a new one. You know, it's never. Well, been I don't done think before. they're going to do that, but that would certainly be. Uh, well, it's a way to it's a way to avoid having to come up with a way to. Have the winner not win the championship in a creative way, you know, because or 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 or, or win the, win the championship. So I don't know what they're going to do with um, Bobby. I mean, like you know, they're going this month with Kofi Kingston because Money in the Bank's the draw. Because um, Kofi Kingston's clearly not ready for that spot. Um, he just lost to McIntyre in his qualifying match just a couple weeks ago, and. Uh, it's just you know an, an opponent for now, and then obviously on the next show, you know they got to find somebody. Can't be Drew McIntyre. So um, Lesnar, there's nothing with Lesnar right now. I mean, I know people have said different, but as of this afternoon, there's still nothing with Lesnar. Um, you know, I suppose they could, you know, you can always throw money at him. But the the, the thing with Lesnar though is there's there then becomes a really I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but it is at the same way. If they put Lashley against Lesnar, they're not going to put the title on Lesnar because generally he's going to come back and wrestle a lot. So Lashley would have to win. But then do they want Lashley to beat him and then have him do his feud with Roman Reigns, which they could do because it'll be so long before it. And, you know, it's like they could do that. But uh, there will be arguing about that, I would think, if if that thing is considered. So, and then we're stuck with uh, Bray Wyatt. You know, they took uh, Bray Wyatt's theme song away from Alexa Bliss, so that that scares me. That he's coming back, or or he's, I shouldn't say scared. I shouldn't be scared that he's coming back because he's got to come back. It's his job. Um, so he could it could always be him. Um, although you know him and Bobby Lashley actually sounds really horrible. Bad. Yeah, yeah, the way that mixes, that's not a good mix at all. Well, I don't think there's anybody that mixes good with his Bray White character. 
I mean, maybe Bray White is a worker, but I mean, Bray White is a character. There aren't that many with Bray White. There aren't that many with Bray White as a worker either. Well, there was one, and it was Kevin Owens, which brings us to Kevin Owens. What's going on with him? He's taking time off. But I was told it's storyline related. So there you go. Hey, if you're a big fan of Wrestling Observer Radio, we got 12,000 episodes of all of our podcasts up at our website, WrestlingObserver.com. If you sign up today, you get access to every single one of them. The 12 to 18 new shows that we do every single week. You can podcast them, listen to them on the road, at work, working out, in the shower, wherever you listen to your podcasts. And also full access to the Wrestling Observer newsletter and archives. So if you love what you hear, head to WrestlingObserver.com. 12,000 audio shows at your fingertips.